I arrest, time in city jail, and still have to be at work in the morning. Sound rough? Well, police say that's been the last 24 hours for one pro golfer who's in the Valley for the Phoenix Open. ABC 15's John Erickson with the story. And John, we've heard a lot of the warnings about drunk driving. It's a weekend when golf and drinking go together for a lot of people here in Scottsdale. And police have been warning fans, don't drive home after drinking. But this DUI arrest story, not about a fan, but a player. This was pro golfer Stephen Bowditch yesterday. This was Bowditch today. And this was Bowditch in between. Scottsdale police say they found him asleep behind the wheel at Scottsdale Road in Lincoln Drive just after 1 this morning. Police say his blood alcohol level was above .20. That's more than double the legal limit. Police say he spent part of the night here, Scottsdale City Jail, then bonded out and made it to work. But he missed the cut. He won't be playing tomorrow. Got the police. The arrest details are similar to another pro athlete, former Cardinals player Michael Floyd. Step, Step out, out of the, the car. car. Step out. Step out. Scottsdale police arrested him in December. Police say they found him passed out behind the wheel too. And just as police have been at the open all week, they are here in Old Town tonight. We tried to reach Bowditch for comment. He didn't answer a phone call. He also didn't go to the media room to take questions after playing today. Back to you. Thank you, John. ADOT back with their clever message boards trying to keep you safe on the roads. In addition to the Phoenix Open, we also have Super Bowl this weekend, making this message timely. You might have seen these signs. They say, blow the whistle on distracted driving. A 40-year-old woman found dead in a parking lot.